Hello, good evening, and welcome to a new episode of um, Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. And we are currently back on Cepho, and we are looking into the second dig site on Cepho. And you'll probably remember from the last episode that we were able to up um, BD1's abilities to go up the zip line, um, other than just down it. So we're now just testing that out. Um, what I'll do is I think I should probably just save that before we do it because I don't know where the next um, actual meditation point is so right so now Thanks, BD. No. Right, so now so we need to go over here. Okay, so we need to go through the other way. That's essentially what they're saying. Um, just check and see if there's nothing to investigate here. Why would he not hit back at it? Mm. 
Right, so because I've managed to make them respawn, this short. No, BD1, we don't want to close it again, we want to keep it open. Come on. So what on earth are you doing, BD1? Uh, that was the way we just came, wasn't it? So we're going this way. I'm watching you. Oh, you're not really? running away. Wow, that was quick. Got something? Mind doing an overcharge? Throw me a stim BD. I guess we need to go down that way then. Why is BD1 not catching on to that? So I know that there's something up there, so I want to try and get that before... So we've got to get on to these bits here.
Why would you not just jump onto the blasted weed thing? Okay, I didn't think he was actually going to do it, to be quite honest. I'll be sitting here forever and a day trying to get him to do that. But we made it. And thankfully we can actually... Um, meditate here so that um, we can at least save. Now I do believe we had a skill point to use as well. Um, I'm tempted to almost leave it to get the two skill point one, but let's see. Yeah, let's just get that. So I will say that you are probably finding that I am doing some bits and pieces that are going to be frustrating. Um, for me much and then more than anything else is for you but I can assure you if you watch anybody else that has played this game they have had very much a similar experience so please do not think for one minute um, that I'm the only one that's gone through this although I'm pretty sure um, there will be others Oh, Justice. second sister. Oh yes, I know your name, your past, and most importantly, about Cordova. Tell me, why did he hide the holocron? Outstanding. That would not be. I will destroy you. You're falling behind. Such poor performance. This is too easy. <laughs> Not quite as gifted as Sears' last apprentice, but not bad. Hmm. Keeping count. I'm surprised she didn't tell you. Sarah was never good at keeping secrets. And you know her so well, huh? Mm. <laughs> she was weak. 
cracked in an imperial torture chair, surrendered the location of her naive Padawan, they would never have found me. If it wasn't for her, she betrayed me. Petrilla. In the flesh. I won't let you manipulate me. So sure are you? When <laughs> faced with a choice to protect herself or her Padawan, she chose self-interest. She'll sell you out, too. Well, I can handle myself. <laughs> Can you afford to take that chance? Your new master harbors great darkness. The look on her face when she saw what they had done to me, as I am now. She turned, exposing her true nature. She used the dark side. She cut herself off from the Force. Oh? How long before she cracks and betrays you too? Is that who you want beside you when you find the Holocron? What would Jaro Tapal say? You have no right to mention his name. I wonder, what would he think if he could see his Padawan now, skulking in the shadows with a betrayer, granting her access to a legion of impressionable students? No. I won't let anyone touch them. I thought the same thing once. You have to admit, it's... I, I'm not going to lie when I say this is... That's a brilliant storyline. Uh, I mean, BD1, thank you for saving the life there, to be perfectly honest. I don't think we can get that, what's it? So, um, it's just as well we saved beforehand. So, I've actually made it to the tomb, which is something I never thought I would do. Which was part of my reluctance to actually... Thanks for the help back there, BD. You saved my life. And got us closer to the tomb. than the other tomb. I don't know. I don't like it. I found it. Oh. I found it. But it's here. Why didn't you tell me? Because she's a liar. You. How? Oh. How? I rerouted communication the moment... I rerouted communication the moment you tried to contact her. Slicing encrypted transmissions was always a pastime of hers. Slicing encrypted transmissions was always a pastime of hers. She taught me one. There's no technique Sarah has that I haven't perfected. No. 
Well, why do they do this to the tombs, really? Is it you press one button it doesn't agree with you you press another button it doesn't agree with you and then literally about after you've done about 20 fails suddenly oh I'm going to work see look again No, seriously. Oh, you know what? One, I'd wish this blasted fan would stay in its position because it's actually got hotter than it was earlier. So the heat is certainly not helping me concentrate here. Wow, I mean just wow. Do you think you could actually just work? This is the bit I thought I would have difficulty with. Right, Cal, I didn't want you to go straight in there because I thought it might, you know, you never know, there might be something worth investigating there, but... See, this is why I would never make a good Jedi. <laughs> I, don't, I don't stay patient for long. You could let me out of the corner. I'll get you. You were saying, Where's your other friend gone, or is he dead? I'm guessing he's dead then. something? My friend, these devices appear to simulate this planet's gravitational pull. I can't help but see it as a motif. I really think, to be perfectly honest, that um, if Eno Cordova had been here before, why on earth are we going through all this rubbish? Right, meditate, because I think we're going to need it. Right, I need to be wary, because I think this produ might produce an enemy here, as this does tend to be spawn enemies around. Oh, 
Okay. You're running out of time. For what? My scouts located an artifact of interest at the rear of this tomb. Even now I'm studying it. Learning his secrets. It seems Cordova was rather taken with these Zepho. Yeah, they're making great progress. Down there. Am I all that's left? Apparently so. <laughs> right, okay, so You need to be on a ball to do the safe thing. Okay. Pretty sure I don't want to be going down that way. Oh, there's another meditation point. And of course it's going to respawn all the things, so uh, maybe I won't meditate for the minute. So somehow we're getting across this gap. Better double back and tell the squad. Jedi. You were saying? Wow, I didn't think I was actually going to do that on the first go. Oh no, not these things again. <laughs> uh, sort you out, didn't it? More of my soldiers breach this tomb every minute. Afraid to face me yourself? Had your droid not intervened, I would have killed you with ease. It's okay, buddy. Just ignore her. Oh, no. Okay, let's survey this. Why do they make it so difficult to get to the tomb? Wow, 
You stupid thing, really? Seems to be making a real success for that, don't you? And that's all I needed. Right, so, where am I going now? Is there any purpose to going this way? I guess so. You're not getting out of here alive. Okay, so you just give me empty threats, are you? BD, help please. So you don't want to scan him before I go? Okay, um, this is the, that was the way I just came, wasn't it? Here, 
there's a life essence in there I can see, but I can't. Get in there to get it. Something tells me I've got to come back for that at some point, somehow. The way I meant. No. Okay. Um, I think before I have to go through all that rigmarole again. We're going now. Why would I backtrack to where I just came from? I really don't have any idea where I'm going to now. Oh, okay. <laughs> I killed it. Killed you. This is way, way, way complicated. More than I would like to think, but sure I've got a good mind for puzzles. Headbutting me, you horny thing, whatever you're called. 
Imagine the artifacts the Empire would have missed if it weren't for your intervention on this backwater planet. Sure it's worth the cost? I hear Project Dog is at a high price. Stormtroopers and workers. Expendable resources. You're a monster. I am what Sarah made me. No, you're what the dark side made you. Right, is there actually points coming to this bit or what? Right, so something tells us we'll be going in this direction. Oh. Bloody rat things! We've got to do some surfing again now. Assuming there's something worth going over there for, or she wouldn't be there, would you? I've taken the artifact back to my ship for analysis. Pity you couldn't make it in time. Doesn't matter what you steal, you'll never understand it. Yet you do? You'll find out soon enough. I'll take those off. Alright, okay. So. I guess we're going next way then. Okay. Oh, this is a bit behind the thing, isn't it? We can't, this is something we can't actually do yet. I think I've come the wrong way. Did I go the wrong way or...? Okay. Go up.
Well, that was close as hell. Can I now just get down? Right, okay, so let's meditate because should anything happen, we'll come back to this. Oh, I've got one skill point. Let's go to the skill tree. I think that's the way essentially I've got to go now because they haven't seen us. Keep your guard up. I gotta go that way? No, because um <coughs> Oh right, yeah, this is Something while examining. I noticed something while examining the sarcophagus. It's a very you know. convenient location to dispose of nuisances. You lured me here. Was this your plan all along? You truly have the wits of a scrapper. I'm picking up on something. Look alive! Don't let him escape! Well, you, if you're going to kick me off, then no. Sorry, just hold on a minute. My powers just suddenly decided on the TV, just suddenly decided right in the middle of that battle. <laughs> This is where we're going to learn a new skill. Yep. 
I thought so. Padawan, where is the Force? Everywhere. It is within me. It surrounds me. Just so. It connects you. There will be times when emotion, pain, or exhaustion trick you. You will feel cut off, isolated. You know me so well, this Master. This is an illusion. Your lightsaber lies there, out of reach, but you remain connected through the Force. Feel that energy around you and summon your weapon. All right. Forces within you, around you, connecting you to your weapon. You must ignore all distraction. Force is with me. It connects us. So I've learned to pull. No. survived not part of your plan luckily <laughs> I always allow contingencies <sighs> you can imagine just imagine how relieved I am <laughs> oh new skill available Cal has healed his connection with the force hurrah So I've got new skills I can do now. Power throw. Oh god. Okay. So the power of friendship, huh? I think I'm going to have to do some serious working on um, fighting some purge soldiers and things like that to get some of them up. Right, so I'm guessing we don't need to go back that way because... My hands are getting seriously sweaty and it's not allowing me. Oh. 
I'm trying to pull it. My hands are sweating so much, Chuck. I'm Either let me destroy you or... Oh, this is getting on my nerves now. Well, it certainly took me long enough. Anyway, I'm going to end it here. So thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed what you saw, please hit the like and subscribe button and the notification bell. And um, for when I've uploaded a new video, I will record the next part straight away so um, we can get off with this dreadful planet um, feeling at the moment. So again, thank you very much for watching. Hit the like and subscribe button and the notification bell for when I've uploaded a new video. And have a very good evening.